I mean, I guess, can I ask you in your conversations with your clients, how do you help them empower them, you know, or normalize this? Because what if they're embarrassed or what if they're like, you know, well, I, I'm not going to start doing jumping jacks in front of people. Or, you know, like how, how do you help walk them through this? Um, um, like, well, there's and, and always figure music. out how to do it. Yeah. There's always yes. music, right? And yes. who's going to, who is going to say anything to an adolescent or a teenager who's like got their headphones on and doing mm -hmm. their thing with their music, right? So yeah, the younger kids will do the jumping jacks. The older kids probably gonna get some groove with their music and you get uh -huh. really into hearing the music, hearing the tunes, and then you're able to let go of whatever it is that kind of hijacked your brain, right? Mm -hmm. And laughter, mm -hmm. I mean, they're always looking on their phones. So what I yes. say is, um, why don't you save something that's hilarious, play it out, and you know you don't have to go far, but it makes you laugh. It turns that frown upside down, right? And you feel better. Yes. Um, yeah. Importantly, is to know when you're starting to feel the worries come on, and then know that you have you know one, two, or three things in your toolbox that you can do, and then mm -hmm. use one of them. But in order for those tools to be very inherent and at the snap of the finger, you have to practice that. And I think that's the challenge is that they will do it with me, but then they forget, right? Um, mm -hmm. So I say, well, you know, pick one thing, do it for a week, pick another thing, do it for a week, see which jives with you. And kids will come back and tell me right away, like, oh yeah, that breathing thing, Dr. T, I can't do it. You know, but um, the laughter, like, you know, some funny joke or something. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Or music. I mean, music, is, I think, brings in a lot of adolescents, right? It's probably rare to have an adolescent who's not into some kind of music. So mm -hmm. it releases stress or it brings them to their happy place, you know, 